I've lived in Oklahoma City and Edmond, and I lived in Granite, Oklahoma, which is very small. I also lived in McAllister, and, but the majority of the time I grew up in Edmond, and now I live in downtown Oklahoma City. I was very excited uh, to have the opportunity, and Noble has given me a lot of opportunities since I've been with him, and I'm very grateful and appreciative of that. It means a lot that he would trust me enough to give me that opportunity, and I'm very grateful. We were so excited about that also. Not surprised necessarily because um, Noble, every contact we have with him, he was always telling us about how exceptional she was and she was doing just wonderful and that he was so proud of her. And so um, we were excited for her, but, but really not so surprised. He, he was able to recognize what, what a diamond she was. And so that was, that was good for us. She has compassion for people. She's always shown that in her life. Um, she'll be there. Um, she won't just know you today, she'll know you five years from today. And that's the thing I think that separates Jordan. Once you meet Jordan and she connects with you, or even if she doesn't connect with you, you know that it's somebody that's told you the truth that will give you 110% of everything she is. Jordan's been the peacemaker in her whole life. She's always been the person in her core group, of people that she truly calls friends. She can sit down with you and tell you the truth. I enjoy being here in Oklahoma. It's obviously the only place I have ever lived. Certainly I could go live somewhere else, but my family is here, uh, which is the most important to me. My friends are also here. I also have been given an amazing opportunity um, in the legal field right here in Oklahoma. And I want to be able to give back to the community and back to the state where I've grown up and I want to continue to live here and continue to help my fellow Oklahomans. 